Aw, Kimmy, how was school? Ugh, it was all right. Film studies was fine, but I was bored out of my mind during equestrian history. These books are so old, even the dust has dust. Good to hear, actually. Guess what I got? What are these? Well, you know me, I pulled a few strings at work. Well, not literally strings, mind you, it's just an expression, sweet ups. And I managed to score these tickets to the Spring Sovereign Soiree. Now I know it isn't the same as the Summer Sun Celebration or what is it, the Grand Galloping Get Together or whatever they call it, but the princesses will be there. Ugh, the princesses? No offense, Mom, but I read enough about them in these old things. Plus, they're on Ponyville so often, it seems pointless. Did I mention that Discord will be there? Really? <gasps> thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Anything for you, sweetums. Have fun now! <laughs> Let me tell you a new story. Once upon a time, in the magical land of Equestria, where we live, there were two beautiful princesses, Princess Celestia, who raises the sun, and Princess Luna, who raises the moon. Now, these princesses were always nice and kind to their subjects. But one day, there was an evil beast who threatened to take over everything we held dear. He was made up of all sorts of limbs and had fiery red eyes. He wanted to hurt every pony by making life miserable. Luckily, the great princesses were able to stop the evil discord and bring harmony to all the land. The end. Mommy? Yes, honey? Was discord always evil? I think so. Why? Well, I don't know. He just was. Some ponies are just bad. But that makes no sense. There had to be a reason. Maybe he was lonely. Maybe he just didn't have any friends and wanted the princesses to play games with him. What if Discord asked Celatia and Wuna to play and they said no? And then he gets super sad and lonely and cries because he's so lonely. <sighs> Maybe not, Kimmy. Maybe not. Announcing Princess Celestia. You nervous? Excuse me, princess, but considering I'm an immortal spirit of chaos, I'm quite certain I have far more experience dealing with the lowly proletariat than you. Something to the order of, oh, five or six millennia? Well, gee, I was just trying to be supportive. More like trying to be nosy. In fact, why don't they just rename you the Princess of Meddling? Oh, wait, even better, the Princess of Nosiness. Yes, I think that most certainly fits you and your heavenly nostrils far better. Announcing Princess Twilight Sparkle. Your fear is palpable, Discord. Fear? What fear? You must be quite mistaken. You may think you are alone, but you are not the only pony here who has a past transgression to atone for. It wasn't long ago that I was facing fears not so different from your own. After all, these ponies have only seen the less respectable side of you. I understand your plight. It will take time for them to see the good in you. But that time will come. You just need to have a little patience and a little faith. Announcing Princess Luna! I believe that is my cue. Good fortune to you, Discord. And in his first public appearance, Discord, Spirit of Chaos. Discord? Didn't he used to talk?
torture them. Princess should have that beast up there. Get off the stage! You suck!